Hi, oh, YouTube. It's Patrick. Uh, I was going to put up another Blu-ray review of something, uh, but then I figured that Game of Thrones comes back next week, so I'll just talk about the Season 1 Blu-ray, uh, which looks great. Uh, the show was shot on a um, new specific like digital camera, uh, so it looks as good as any Blu-ray like you would own. Uh, it has a lot of fun commentaries uh, with the, the cast, a lot of fun extras and stuff like that. So if, you, if you've seen the show, you know you should pick this up. Pick it up. Um, I'm not going to go into why you should watch the show if you, uh, if you haven't yet. Um, but season two starts next week. Uh, I can't wait for it. Um, the budget of the show from the first season increased by about 10 million, which is what they need. Um, the two head writers of the show, I think they really have more of a grasp on what the audience liked and didn't like from the first season. So I think they're going to just kind of rectify their problems from the first year um, and really let the things that everyone knew they loved just push them to the forefront. And there's been a couple of reviews already online about the first couple of episodes, and they, it pretty much sounds like exactly that is happening. Uh, the directors of this season, uh, four of the episodes, is directed by Alan Taylor, who did the last two in the first season. Uh, so you know those are going to look good. Um, one of the cinematographers from the first season who did the first two episodes and the last two, they're the four best-looking episodes of the season, he's directing an episode. And Neil Marshall, who did The Descent, is directing episode nine, uh, which is the episode that the author of the series, George Martin, wrote. Um, it's called Blackwater, and anyone that... I'm not going to go into what it is, but anyone that's read the books knows that that's going to be like a crazy big episode. The whole cast is saying that's a crazy big episode. Um... You know, the whole season is going to build up to it. So, uh, I'm really looking forward to it. People are already saying they saw the first four episodes and that they're fantastic. So, if the first four are fantastic, it's, you know, pretty pretty sure that the last, like, half of the season is going to be great, too. Um, I really, I'm not going to go into a long list of what I'm looking forward to, because I'll just say it's pretty much everything. I'm looking forward to everything being faithful, and then all the slight changes, even major changes, some for the better. Um, and honestly, you can't really complain about them making changes because when it gets to the fourth and fifth books, to like to adapt those, they're gonna make a they're gonna need to make a lot of changes because everything gets like way way well you know I forget it, I won't go into it but they're really gonna have to make some changes let's say by then so they might as well start getting used to taking some liberties now. Um, uh, I can just hope that uh, George finishes the books and they you know uh, they don't catch him. He's able to finish it before the writers can finish the show. Uh, I only say that because that means we'd get the next two books within the next, you know, six years or something like that. Uh, which would be nice. Um, trying to think if there's anything about the new season. HBO is about to air their behind-the-scenes look of the new season, which is online already. Um, but I'm going to be doing reviews of the show starting next week. Uh, but anyway, just a quick, like, rehash... Buy the Blu-ray. Watch the show. Um, season 2 starts next week. Uh, I'm pretty sure it's going to be fantastic. I've heard the first hour is, you know, wittier than the first, than, you know, even some of the stuff in the first season was. I, I heard it ends in a real brutal way. Um, so it just sounds, you know, it's going to be a real juggling act for the writers, but I think they're going to be able to do it. And... Um, and anyway, again, that's what the reviews are saying, that it's that they're able to pretty much juggle everything. So I'm, I'm just, I'm, I couldn't be more excited for it. This and Breaking Bad this year, that's like the one-two. Um, and uh, yeah, let me know what you thought. Um, if you have anything you're looking forward to or just anything you want to discuss. Um, when I do reviews of it next week, I'm going to basically do a split, talk about the episode and then talk about like the books and how it, you know, how things worked and how things, you know, were changed and everything like that. Uh, that's going to be kind of the way I approach it. Um, but, uh, yeah. Alright, guys. Later. See you next week.